Princess and the Pea by Susan Middleton Elja, illustrated by Juana Martinez Neal. Let's see what the book is all about. There once was a prince who wanted a wife, but not any niña will do in his life. His mother was speaky. She hoped for perfection. The prince was so lonely, in need of affection. But here came a maiden, en route to her castle. I hope I can stay here. It is not a hassle. She winked at the prince, who fell for her fast. No matter what mom does, I'll marry this lass. The prince said, come in. With mother, la reina, decided to test her. Will this girl be buena? Mama sneaked away to the royal jardin and found a small pea that was fit for a queen. She guarded a pea pod and took to the stair. If this girl is worthy, she'll feel that it's here. She placed El Guisante in the bed for their guest. She yelled, Veinte, mattresses, lofty request. The queen settled in with her box of bonbones, while lots of strong workers came in with colchones. Uno was suave, dos was pequeño, tres was muy grande, cuatro un sueño. Several were pinstriped, some made of fleece, others were dotted or checkered or grease. The queen ate her treats, the bed was stuck high, and right when they finished, la niña came by. Here's your cama, a place you can sleep. Thanks, said the girl. I won't even count sheep. Meanwhile, el principe practiced I do's. He knew that this maiden was one he should choose. I like her, mama. He said with a lilt. We'll see, said the queen as she fluffed up his quilt. The girl stretched her brazos and yawned with her boca. Oh, the bed felt so lumpy, like there was a roca. The little guisante was twenty times deep. Could it be the reason the girl got no sleep? She trudged down to breakfast, her ojos so droopy. And how was your slumber? La reina was snoopy. Great, said the girl, if you like hard and lumpy. Oh, pobrecita, the prince said, you're grumpy. Their guests brightened up as she noticed the lad. Really, she murmured, it wasn't that bad. I thought, La Reina, how she detected. Is she a real princess? I think I suspect it. She signaled her son that the girl passed the test. Drat, she had managed to stave off the rest. The prince soon proposed with a golden anillo. They married a week in the royal castillo. The queen kept her promise and threw a big boda. The bride wore a wedding gown, stylish de moda. Acepto, acepto, they both said. I do. And still, to this day, the queen has no clue. The prince had put pitchforks and stones in la cama to help his true love Past the test of Queen Mama.
the prince and his bride had hijos galore, one for each mattress, and then had no more. And that, my friends, is the end of the story. I'll see you next time. Bye.